What's up guys, Christian is Tech here with a video that is not on YouTube for some reason and I'm here to show, to make it pretty much, I guess. So, um, if you guys have been watching my videos for a while now, you've seen that I have some pretty cool lock screens and backgrounds for my iPod and iPhone both. Now you'll be maybe wondering, where does he get them? Well, in this video I'll be teaching you guys where to get them and how to put them on your device. Now this works with iPod Touch, is uh, iPhones, and I think iPads. I don't know why they shouldn't work, but you can give it a try. As you can see, the background here, here I'll switch as you guys can see. So pretty much, uh, it's an app that you get from the App Store. And yeah, so you get the pictures downloaded to your photos app. And then once from there, you know, you just set it as back to background. Yada yada. Enough of me talking. Let me show you how to get it. So um, the app itself is called Wallpapers HD. So you go to the app store and just type in Wallpapers HD. Once you have it downloaded, you click it. And just p random pictures should like, you know, show at the top here you have re recent popular and random so those are three tabs you can you know click each one different pictures will come out um down here you click this and you have all sorts of categories that you can choose from animals anime artistic companies such as apple um iphone ipods Nature, you know, there's a lot of ca uh, categories you can choose from. Here, let's choose uh, nature. Now, here we go to iPhone iPods. Click done. Now, pictures of, uh, I guess, a military are going to come up. I don't know. But you get the thing, the deal. So, I'm going to click all. Now, let me show you how to download this. Um, as you can see here, this is a background for the iPod iPhone. You, you can tell, you know. So, um, yeah. Once you choose it, uh, you will get four little icons. Uh, these two, this one and that one is two. Switching between uh, pictures, this little four squared one is to go back to this. And the two arrow looking upward, so you can actually download it. So now you get three options, download, read, and share. You can click download. Now it's going to ask you if it like to select an image size. Since this is being a background, you want it to be full. Um, if, it's, if you want it to be uh, your lock screen, so when you go to check your timer or whatever, you're going to choose fitted. But in this case, it's a background, so I'm going to choose full. So once it's downloaded, it's automatically going to put it in your photos, as it said right there. So now we go to our photo app. It should pop right there. Now once you're, you know, you're here, just click this uh, icon right here, and you put a use as wallpaper, set, home screen, and ta-da. Um, easy and simple, which is what I love about this app. Um, no, not right now. Uh, let me download a fitted one so you guys can see. That line looks pretty cool. Alright, so once you're here, you're going to do the same step. These two, download, and this time you're going to choose fitted because it's for your lock screen. So you choose fitted. As you can see, it downloaded quick. It's in my photos. Let's go back. Photos, camera roll, boom. It's right there. Same thing. Click down here. Use as wallpaper. And then, you know, you fit it. Set as lock screen. Boom, boom, and then there it is. So that is all for right now, guys. Um, I thought I'd share it, you know, because I haven't seen a video like this on YouTube, and, I mean, it's cool, you know, like, 
you can pretty much customize your iPhone iPod. So yeah guys, um, if you haven't already, subscribe up here. Uh, give me a thumbs up if you actually tried it and it actually worked. And I'll catch you guys later. Peace.